Give me five minutes to give you a proper introduction to After Effects, from UI to animation, text, shapes, and rendering. Deal? Let's go. This is the After Effects interface. Top left is the project panel, where you import media. At the bottom, you have the timeline panel, where you animate. Composition panel at the center, where you see your animation. Effects and presets, preview, and toolbar are at the top. This is your animation toolkit. All right, now let's start using it. Animation in After Effects is all about keyframes. You set values at different points in time, and After Effects fills in the motion. To animate position, select the layer, hit P, click the stopwatch, move forward in time, and change the position. Done. It works the same for all the other properties. Now, make it smooth with the graph editor. Click the graph icon, select your keyframes, and adjust the curve for motion ease in and out. You can also hit F9 to easy ease them. All right, next is text and character panel. Add text by hitting Ctrl T or Command T, then type whatever you want. Change fonts, sizes, tracking, and alignment with the character and paragraph panels. To animate text, use the same keyframe system, or explore animate, which under that you can find position, opacity, and scale for advanced controls. Now let's move on to shapes and masks. Click the shape tool to create rectangles, circles, or polygons. Hold shift to keep perfect properties. Use fill and stroke options at the top to style them. Each shape has content and transform inside the layer, separate from the main transform. Use these shapes as masks or draw custom masks with the pen tool. Now onto expressions. Expressions are like mini scripts to automate stuff. Hold Alt or Option and click a stopwatch. Then type an expression. Popular ones are loop out that loops an animation, wiggle that makes it shake, and time to animate over time. These save hours of manual work, so make sure to use them. Ready to export your masterpiece? Go to Composition, Add to Render Queue, or use Media Encoder for better formats. In Render Queue, click Output Module. Choose QuickTime or H264. Set your output location, then hit render. You just learned After Effects in under 5 minutes. So, keep practicing, download templates, and explore more advanced tools. Good luck. This is the end, beautiful friend.